Good morning, guys. Today is Sunday. Um, CJ and his dad went to church. I kind of stayed up too late, so when it was time to get it, get up and go to church, I just couldn't do it. But anyway, I just made my coffee, and I got this cute new Libra cup. It's kind of big, but mm, I guess. But I got this at uh, TJ Maxx. No, Ross. I got it at Ross, and we are trying a new creamer french vanilla creamer real cream made with real cream i've never tried that brand before but we about to see so today's sunday like i said um we might be doing something today i don't know right now i'm just chilling in bed until they get back home and then get on some clothes i really need to take some photos um and a couple of outfits that i have um so we'll see what happens it's a nice day today sun is out so who knows we might even go to the beach but yeah i'll talk to you guys later so good morning guys today is monday the i think the 18th yeah <laughs> it's monday the 18th um of course you ready to take the kids to the school um, no, yes, sir. Yep, you're going to go to school, and you're going to have a good day, right? Okay. Okay. So, that's basically it. Um, Today, I'm going to get my nails done. Um, I still got some more little Christmas shopping to do. And that will be my day. Really and truly, nothing. <laughs> so, yeah. So I just got my nails done, picked up the rest of the um, Christmas gifts for the teachers, and now I'm headed to get me something to drink because I'm dying of thirst. It is hot as hell today. <laughs> um, and then get something to eat and run to the post office to ship off orders for Luxurious and um, ship off, of course, stuff to go back home to Atlanta. And that is all. And then pick up the kid after that. And then we, I don't know, we might go to the beach today because it is seriously, it's hot. Hot as hell today and a nice day. So that's what we might do. Go to the beach so I can get some sun and get a little dog. <laughs> All right, y'all. So my stuff from Ulta came today. And this is actually not the first stuff that I ordered from Ulta. But I figured I would um, share what I had got from Ulta. This is like my second order from them. So anyway, uh, what I got was the B6 Vitamin Infused Complex Prep Priming Spray. And I've been actually wanting to try this for a while now. Um, so I'm, so I'm excited to give this a whirl and um, see how it is. Especially like here, you know, living in Hawaii and when the summertime comes around, rolls around, it's really hot. So... I feel like this is this will be a good vitamin infused complex spray and you also you don't have to um or just a spray to kind of keep your face moisturized I guess because uh, let's see it says it's a skin balancing even skin tone oil absorbing so it, it absorbs the oil which you know here in Hawaii you be you can sweat and if you have oily skin uh you know look kind of rather oily or shiny so I can't wait to give this a try um so yeah so i got that and this alone is like 32 dollars. so for all the stuff that i got um it was a total of like 39 dollars. of course did i pay shipping i don't think i paid shipping but um so yeah because you know ulta they have the points so i think i had like 700 points so i used all 700 points to get this stuff and it yeah it kind of helped out a lot <laughs> and then i'm gonna try this shower shake beauty zoli or zoli beauty and the packaging is very very cute so i'm gonna give this a whirl and see how this is oh they got it taped i want to smell it see what it smells like oh it smells it didn't i mean it doesn't really have a smell hmm maybe it'll have a smell when i actually use it but this is a moisturizing body wash. So we'll see how that goes. I'll probably talk about this in a product review and let you guys know how that is. And then of course I had to order the NYX Duo uh, Chromatic 
lip gloss and I believe that these are the new the new NYX colors so this one's like a purple and it's called what is this one called I think it's called gypsy dreams and then this one is called crushing it and it's really pretty um when I do my product review I'll share with you guys what they look like do swatches and stuff like that but they had other colors but I'm gonna give these colors a try first to see if I like them uh, or if I don't like them so yeah that's all the stuff that I got from Ulta for my first or second order my first order it should be here today because I ordered perfume so um, I will share that with you guys as well
I'm here at the post office, just dropped some stuff off, and now I'm waiting in the car to get CJ, because the post office literally is right down the street from his school. So, I'm just chilling in the car right now. Um, I had made a stop at McDonald's, and let me tell you about this McDonald's. This McDonald's is ever. It used to be the bomb, so I don't know if they've hired some new people or what. So, I get on the mic, and I tell the lady... Uh, bacon ranch chicken salad and you could tell she spoke another language so she couldn't understand what I was saying so I probably said bacon ranch chicken salad probably about three four times so I was just like you know what if you can't find the button don't worry about it so I get to where I go pay and the guy was like um I said who y'all got on the mic today because um you know they don't know what they're doing so I told the guy to give me a bacon ranch chicken salad so he rings me up, I pay for it. Then I drive up to the next window to pick up the order. Go to pick it up, get the fries, get the drink. And lo and behold, my bacon ranch chicken salad is not ready. How you don't have no damn salad ready? The salad is all it should already be prepared and you have to give them out by a certain time, I would think. I don't know. I've never worked McDonald's, so I wouldn't know. So anyway, of course, you know, you had to pull up and wait for the salad, but the way this McDonald's is set up, it's like a little corner for you to pull up to, and it's hard to get out of. So I was just like, okay, I'll go to the parking lot. Go to the parking lot. Lady comes out, doesn't see my car. <laughs> so she's walking around with a chicken salad. So I have to end up parking the car and go get out my car to go get my damn salad. I said, I'll be damned. Like, what's the point of having fast food and and they can't get shit together and this mcdonald's has been slipping on a lot of stuff so i think i'm just i really don't fuck with mcdonald's like that but cj eats it and it's just a lot going on because of course the holidays and stuff so i'm not looking to cook nothing really so it's just something quick easy to go but I, i'm just gonna stop fucking with that mcdonald's for, for real I'm, I'm tired of them because they've had too many mess ups for me so yeah Anywho, but yeah, so I'm gonna get out the car and get CJ, and then he has ABA today because today is Tuesday, so ABA with uh for him today, and it's gloomy, y'all. It's been gloomy for like a couple of days. I don't know what's going on in Hawaii this year, but I've never seen Hawaii be this damn gloomy and rainy, especially on the side that we live on. If you've lived in Hawaii or you're from Hawaii, Ever Beach rarely sees rain or is gloomy or anything like that. So, yeah. But anywho, let me get off of here and I will hit y'all back later. Good morning. Today is Wednesday. One more day of school for CJ and he is out. Thank God. Right, CJ? Say yay. Right? Oh, he's busy with some toy. Um, but yeah, today's Wednesday. Um, nothing uh, really going on today. After I drop him off, I'm going to go back home. Start working on the vlog. Uh, clean the house a little bit. Wrap some presents a little bit. And that'll be it, baby. Um... Today's an early, well not early release, but today's Wednesday, so they get out of school a little early, so if it doesn't rain today, because we starting off no sun today, it's a little dark, um, cloudy and stuff, so if it doesn't rain or anything like that, we might go somewhere today, I don't know, because it's really, I mean, once you live the island life and done everything on the island, it don't be nothing else to do. So, but go eat or go shop or something. But other than that, it'll be nothing to do. So, that's going to be my day. Hopefully, all of y'all are having a blessed day on this Wednesday. Even though you guys, once you guys see the video. But anyway, I just hope everybody's having a good day. So, I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs> Bye. Y'all want to know something that's super annoying? I'm about to show y'all what is super annoying right now. I took the whatever fire alarm thing off the or out of the little socket thing so yeah okay i took it out and you know like when it starts beeping you're like oh i'll just take it off you heard that yeah so here it is right here still beeping i tried to open it i don't know how to open it so i have to wait 
for the husband to come back home i guess to take the battery out of it so i have been listening to this damn thing beep all damn day i had to <laughs> it was really getting on my nerves i just took it out of cj's one of his book bags because it's super annoying so after i took it out or from the wall or from the ceiling <laughs> i uh what was i doing i started cooking some coffee or heating up some coffee and the shit was beep. Well, I said, I know you fucking lying. So, yeah. I'm like, please hurry up and come home to, to open this damn thing up and trust. I have tried to open it. I don't know how to open it. But this is aggravating. That's all. So, hey, guys. Oh, it's a rainbow back there, CJ. So, hey, guys. Today is Thursday. And it's CJ's last day of school. Yay. Yay. Yeah, yeah. That cat way over there. That cat ain't gonna get you. CJ's scared of cats, like terrified of cats. Like if you see a, see a cat, you gotta pick his ass up. But uh, <laughs> um, he gone. See, cat gone. So today is Thursday. Um, CJ has a Christmas party at his school today. You guys are gonna get pizza. No, I want a pizza, JJ. You're getting pizza today. Miss Our car is gonna buy you pizza. I want JJ. What is that? Drink, drink. I don't know what that is. So, yeah. And my day is going to consist of wrapping presents. And that might be it. Oh, y'all got to see this rainbow. Hold on. Let me see if I can get this rainbow for y'all. It's so pretty. Can y'all see that? Probably not. Nope. They can't see it, CJ. Well, it's in the, the mirror. Can y'all see it in the mirror? There you go. It's a pretty rainbow. See it, Doug? So yeah, anyway, a rainbow back there. I just had to show y'all that <laughs> off topic. But um, yeah, to me, I, to, for my day, I'll be wrapping presents today and um, that'll be it. Today's Thursday, he has ABA after school. So that's, that's about it. Today is like the first day we have sun. Hopefully it stays <laughs> sunny today. And that's all, say bye. 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 <laughs> okay, so CJ is home from school. There he is laying over there. And I just wanted to vlog with you guys and show you just how generous, like, um, how, I don't know, how the classes are. Like, when he was in pre-K, he got a lot of stuff. When he, in, you know, kindergarten, they do a lot of, the parents really do participate and do a lot of things um, out here for the kids. So, at, uh, at his school, he got, um, I guess, he got like a free little book um, for his little present. Um, the teacher had a really cute idea. She had all the parents bring like a $5 gift or under $5 gift. And they had the, the children pick whatever present they wanted to. And she had like a little small Christmas tree. It was really, really cute. So he got this little thing. Somebody made it. Mm, I don't know how I feel about homemade shit. Mm, I'll probably let Corey, Big Corey, eat this. And he ended up, I guess this is like the hot cocoa where it's like the snowman, I'm guessing. Yeah, it's like a story about this where you do the hot, co hot cocoa and the snowman melts. So he got that. And I think somebody else did that too. Um, it's another person that did that. And then this one was on the floor. Another little bag just, I mean, filled with who knows what candy or whatnot. And then this was his little stocking that they made and then it's got his little it's got his little picture on it and then it says his name let's see what's in your stocking cj so in his stocking he got i don't know what these are strawberry something this is like a japanese type little gift it's like a japanese little gift um and then somebody else did the whole snowman thing it looks like it's got marshmallows or just, I guess, for your hot chocolate. So that's a big thing. I mean, this is probably like a the best gift because it was cold. It's been cold here. This would have been perfect for yesterday. And let's see. What else, CJ? He got... One of your teachers gave you a card. Or somebody gave you a card. Merry Christmas. It's not open. I'll open it in a minute. And, of course, the classic. Everybody does a little candy cane. Reindeer. Cute little... Uh, inexpensive little thing to do what else you got he got another little card this is from Maria 
So let's see what Maria gave you. He made a little ornament. Oh, look, CJ, you made a cute little ornament. That's awesome. Something fell off. Then another bag filled with candy and whatnot in it. Just junk. <laughs> junk. See, inexpensive candy canes. A lot of people gave out candy canes. This is says, Happy Holidays. Don't eat the decoration. Logan. Okay. Oh, don't eat the decoration. Oh. I like this candy. I don't know. Co Logan said you can't eat it. It's Yeah, I guess it's an ornament. It's a cookie ornament. You can't eat that. Have a we'll open it in a minute. It's good. And this. CJ, this is not yours. This, this went to rachel i guess because they somebody didn't read it that's what it was somebody didn't read that those aren't oh well hopefully somebody didn't get one candy cane another candy cane what else oh look at this a lot of the um they give a lot of filipino type little things and japanese type little things um oh wait so no more candy cane no you already had one no you already had one you're not gonna eat another one all right let's see Sorry guys with the camera, I'm everywhere. And then somebody gave fruity stuff. A ring pop and so that was nice. All right, so let's see what's in your little cards. Let me turn this around. Let's see from Maria. Let's see what Maria gave. She gave a cute little card. This is how you say um, Merry Christmas in Hawaiian I'm not gonna mess it up but for those that know how to say it there you go but y'all ain't gonna get me I ain't gonna mess it up mm -mm. and then it just says love Maria oh Maria she uh oh she got my little card so my love Maria uh-huh let me find out CJ and then this one I don't know it just says Merry Christmas uh of course Merry Christmas in Hawaiian I ain't gonna mess it up. I know how to, I, I can say it, but mm -mm, somebody that's from Hawaii, y'all ain't gonna have no negative comments on my YouTube channel. And of course, Lil' Kenny Kane, everybody did that. This is from Landon. Okay, hey Landon. So that's what came in that. And then he had some stuff in his, some other stuff in his book bag. Let me see. I know some of y'all are like, Leslie, we really don't care. He got some type of little fidget little spinner. This is more than likely is probably from his um, kindergarten teacher, probably. So, I don't know. It's just a little fidget thing for them to do. Because um, CJ has string, so they're trying, to get, trying not to have him with the string. They're trying to have little other options. Here, that's a little fidget thing. I don't know what it does. It's just a fidget. And that was it. So, I just wanted to share with you guys what he had got in his little stocking and um like i say every holiday whether it's uh christmas halloween thanksgiving they always come home with something for the most part everybody in the classroom uh participates so i just think it's you know amazing um you know how everybody you know comes together and makes sure that you know the kids Bobby, have because there Bobby, is a lot of homeless kids here yes Bobby. Will you go store? Okay, I will. So, I just want to share that with you guys. So, yeah, I will talk to y'all.